Look at these two, look. You got you got Peter the Penguin wearing a little hat. <laughs> you got a little Dennis with a little weapon. Doing quite cool, isn't it? These guys are well, actually, they're friendly. They're only play fighting. Hello, this is Sophie Lawson from SophieLawson.com, and this is another click look video where we click look at various art books and magazines. And today we are looking at. A brand new issue of the character design quarterly magazine it's actually still in its little wrapper it's just popped through my letterbox <laughs> so little Dennis has come out of hiding to help us but before we get into that I just wanted to say earlier today I actually recorded a little click look at this one Peter the Penguin helped us for this one <laughs> it's got a little out on it he, he helped us go through this and it's how to be a children's book illustrator and look how thick it is such a thick book this but it's brilliant I think you're going to love this and this one goes up tomorrow so this one will be going up tomorrow but for this one here little Dennis is going to help us so we're looking at my favourite things which is the character design quarterly magazine by 3 Toto Publishing and the last one we looked at three months ago was this one issue number 16 and I thought it was a really, really nice issue, but it wasn't one of my favourite covers. So before we get into this, I thought I would look at my favourite covers. <laughs> so, my favourite covers so far, I think this one is still my favourite, issue number six. This was a cover by Loish. I love that one. I also like cover number nine, which is a little monster. <laughs> He's cool, he is. Cover number 12. I thought that was beautiful, that one. And then this one here, number 15, this was a Bobby Chi. The old Bobster <laughs> in his little bobsleigh. So these are my four favourites. My favourite is that one, number six, I think. But I'm hoping, let's hope that this one here, which should be number 17, issue number 17, let's hope this one is really cool. So what colour do you reckon it is? Well, I've had a look through my little things. I've had a look through all the issues. And it looks to me like we've never had a yellow one. So I'm hoping that this is a yellow one. Let's have a look. Little Dennis, he's, he's inside. He's got it. It's a white one, is it? That's the bottom. Hey, that's good. We're going to see the bottom first. Oh, yeah. Hey. Looks like it's a pink one. Oh, cool. Well, I like the pink. I like pink and blue, but that's not my favourite character. I can already tell it's not in the top four of my favourites just because I get a feeling when it's a special one when I, I feel it it's weird isn't it, you feel it with this one I'm thinking I love the colours but I'm not so much in love with the character well, I love her little dress look she's got, it's like a little a fishy dress or something <laughs> and what I do like is the way it's like that those, those colours are beautiful We've also got some sort of monster thing here, like a snake. I wish you could smell these issues, they always smell beautiful to me. So let's get inside, little Dennis, he's got to help, help us in here. He's going to help us in, look, boing, look at that. Popping colours. Looks very nice with little Dennis. Subscribe, four issues for £35. That's the little website, look. If you wanted to subscribe, 3dtoto.com slash cdq. So what, what's cool about this is, if you subscribe, you get a little sketchbook as well. Beards. We've got little beards here, look. <laughs> if you wanted to draw little beards. The cover image is by the artist Danny Diaz. What a cool name that is. Danny Diaz. Oh, these are cool. He looks a bit sort of... Um, like a hard bastard and I like the look of that one looks a bit mental I do like, like these little guys Samantha, our little editor it's very beautiful isn't it the way they put these things together I'm just going to go in there a little bit no I'm not <laughs> I like the colours here that pink and blue is beautiful he looks a little bit like one of the Final Fantasy um, characters like the, the creatures Final Fantasy 10 I think it was <laughs> I like him 
Look at him, look. Eating his um, breakfast. Oh, that's a nice one. Nice little face. Yeah, I like these little guys. Very similar. Oh, friendly, look. The brothers, that's called the brothers, that is. Focusing on the mood rather than the details. This is our cover artist, this is. Hey, inside the studio, look. Cool, I love this. This is one of my favourite things in the Imagine FX magazines. When you get to see inside the artist's studio. Oh, that's brilliant, that is. I love that. We've got a little sketches as well. Little sketches. I like that they um, used the colours pink and blue in the sketch as well. It's quite cool. It's a very striking image. Yeah, I feel like maybe it needs that on the front cover. That's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking maybe the front cover's sort of cropped it a bit. Taking away some of the some of the excitement here. Characterise this gate guardian. <laughs> I like this one. Yeah, it's quite funny. It reminds me of um, something from like Mickey Mouse or something. Look at him. Look. He's the sort of guy that in a cartoon, the hero would sort of run around him. So he's big and strong, but it it'd be silly, clumsy, I reckon. Into the deep. Some sort of witch. <laughs> She's cool, I like her. Look at her little saggy tits, look. <laughs> Doing. Digital doodle time. Oh, cool, look. Oh, I love sketches, I do. Oh, I love this one, look. Loads of sketches. I like this, look. Look at that. Cool, aren't they? They're more sort of like, I would say, more sort of like refined sketches. Cool, eh? Creating a criminal, look. Creating a criminal. Sink or swim. They must be um, very mindful of the words they're using here, yeah? I think. Something about that is cool. He looks like um, he's been inside a, a what's it called? Nuclear radiation or something. <laughs> it's quite funny that one. Hey, look at him, look. Hello. He's got a beard as well. Wonder if he did the um, thing on the front. Beardies. We like beards. Size of that screen. Huge. Very colourful, isn't it? Oh, look at this, look. Studio Spotlight Mooty. I like that. Oh, I like these. Mooty, who's this, look? The multi creative South African studio based in Cape Town. Yeah, I like these. Simple. Very weird, isn't it? They've got loads of different styles here. Cool. Little story going on here, look. Which character design projects are you, are you most proud of? <laughs> Pop. Poppy's little belly. Hey, I like him, look. Out in the middle of nowhere. I wonder, I wonder what he's doing out there. Like, does he? Do you think he lives out there? He, he hasn't got a boat or anything. Lighten up with Lin Chen. What's this all about? The use of light is invaluable when telling a story in your designs. Little sketches. Oh, look at this. Oh, cool. Look, they've lit. Look at that. Same character in different lighting. I love that. 
looks like he's um he looks very isn't it weird how different the lighting changes the character the feeling oh yeah <laughs> oh look at the brush strokes I like that little bit there, like the sort of... Oh, what a cool character he is. I like the little mousy as well. Little feet. They're very fluffy, aren't they? I wonder what that was made with. What a software. Oh, this would be a cool one to read. What happens in Vegas? <laughs> Look at him, look. Oh, doggy. Silhouettes. We like our silhouettes. I start to notice sort of common themes. No matter who the artist is, there's sort of common themes here. It's all about silhouettes. Big bastard basic shapes. And then writing. Ideas trash can. A little razzle dazzle. Do the maths. Oh, look at I love that pose. Look at that look. That's my sort of pose, that is. Lots of flowiness. And then it really makes that straightness more powerful, I think. Hello! Oh, she's nice, isn't she? I love it when you see the artists. It's cool, isn't it? Different colours. I like it when they do that as well. Same character, different colours. <laughs> Funny that one is. He could have his own little cartoon, I think. I wonder what little Dennis would think of him. Cool bunch of characters that is. Artist catch up Amanda Jolly. I've heard of this one before. Yeah, look, way back in the very first issue of Character Design Quarterly. Cool. Oh, this would be nice to compare what they're doing now with what they. Because when the, the first one was that, what's that? That's 17 issues ago. 4, 8, 12, 6. That's about four. That's over four years ago, that is. These things have been going for four years. Is there anything new you've learnt or discover about your own creativity or the industry? It's cool, like it'll be really interesting to see artists evolving. Expressing emotions. Ah. Oh. Oh, look. <laughs> oh, I like this. This would be a good one for an article, I think. Compared to two little characters. Yeah, I like Raquel Oshoa. I like the colours on this page. The creature awakens. For this brief, I was given the task to create a character design based on three words heaving, creature and destruction. That's cool, isn't it? Look, see, got the three words here, so the <laughs> Look, oh, I like him. He's just like a head. That looks a bit rude, that one. Look at that for a silhouette. Looks a bit rude to me. Little bit not simple versus complex. I always say I always like simple. I like it simple I do. Line thickness. <laughs> it's quite funny there. Oh look, now that it's got different colours, it's sort of separated it. Yeah, and they've also put extra shapes in here. To sort of, because right there it looked a bit too much like it was one shape. Hmm. 
I like his little face. The gallery, little Dennis's favourite. Look at the emotion in that guy's face there. Oh, I love, the, I love his face. Beautiful. What's that? What do they call that? That, that, what do they call that bit there, look? Profile, isn't it? Something very, very beautiful about that. Yeah, I, I love this bit, the gallery section. Cool. Lots of character, character, character in that dude. I like that as well. That reminds me a bit of um, something. I've seen something like that before. <laughs> I, like, I, wonder what, I wonder what that character's called. Girl Secret Intrigue Red. That must be the four words that they had or something. In this tutorial I will show you how a few short words can inspire and inform a character design. Oh, love that character. I think that's my favourite character so far in this issue. She's a girl. She's definitely got a bit of mystery about her and intrigue. Yeah, and red. Nailed it. That one really pops as well. Oh, yeah. Look at these, look. I like that one, I do. Oh, and that one's cool. Look. These characters are cool, especially this one here. Reminds me of um, Dragon Age. I really like this one as well. See, it's quite cosy in that little outfit. Sexy little shoes. <laughs> we like sexy. Oh, look at this one as well, look. Who's this artist here? What's this artist called? Tara Neff. Karimi. I think that's an artist to look into. Yeah, I love this artist. Lovely little style. Got little, little faces here as well. Look at the little outfits look. Same character, just a slightly bit different. Lady Sexy. I like that. I like that a lot. But there's something about these ones that just is cool. Still love it though. But I don't know, for some reason sketches are more I find sketches more exciting. Lovely that love that pose as well, look. That's an interesting one. Character. I want to know what her name is. Yay, our little faces. I love these. Hello, look. These are our little artist friends. I love that pink as well. Our little contributors. Who have we got here today then? We've got Lin Chen, Danny Diaz. Shannon, little Rudy, <laughs> little Rudy, he's cool. God, there's always sexy people in these magazines. I wonder if that's Amanda Jolly there, she's cool. Look, big happy face. Tamara Karami, that's the one that did my sexy lady. Persian artist based in the Netherlands. She's worked on video games as well. Here he is, look, little Mitch. He looks happy, doesn't he? That's the guy with the beard, Mr. Beardy. Veronica. Hello. <laughs> Who's this here? Oh, look. That's all those little ones that did the studio. And then we got Raquel. Traditional artist there, look. Magical illustrations. Beautiful people. Beautiful artwork. And another beautiful issue. I enjoyed that. 
Little Dennis loved it. He always loves these, he does. That was definitely my favourite. That was my favourite character. My favourite art article thingy. Yeah, I think this is another one I'd turn into a... What do you call it? Article as well. I really like the one over it. I, like, I love this artist. Oh, I love this one as well. Really yeah, fun... Really fun little... I love that as well, little sketchbook bit. Beautiful pink. That was issue number 17 of the Character Design Quarterly magazine. Boing! Hope you enjoyed that, and I'll see you later for another one. <laughs> little Dennis is it? He's gone. <laughs>